Hey, good Sunday morning, guys. It is, I don't know, 7.45 in the morning. This is the chalkboard <clears throat> that I had for a while from Hobby Lobby. I did some um, molds yesterday and put them on, you know, the wood part. And then I spray painted them black. I got this stencil yesterday. I'm so excited about this stencil. So this was my first project of the morning. I'm going to stencil. And <clears throat> then I'm going to paint. And then later on, I'll distress. And the sign will be beautiful and amazing. <laughs> so I wanted to show you this first. <clears throat> and we'll see how it goes. Bye. Moved out from the sign to the studio. And I have a whole bunch of rolling pins to paint the handles on. Um, I'm going to move all the paint into the house today. That is one of my big projects. And I have this and all this stuff to go through. Um, one of our customers came in the other day and was like, Hey guys, my next door neighbors, um, their mother passed away and they're putting everything on the lawn. And you can come pick whatever you want. It's free. So Savannah and I went over there and were able to get some things. Um, nothing like super like off the charts fantastic uh, because people had been there all day, but I was still able to find some things. I moved the white cedar chest out because I'm going to distress that here um, when it's a reasonable hour for people to hear my sander. And I took the desk out. I'm going to just dust it and clean it because that'll get loaded up to go to the antique mall. And right now I'm going to go through some of this stuff and see if there's anything that can go to the antique mall without being altered um, and see if I can make some more room for some of this stuff and that stuff. Um, I did go and get this little cart yesterday. Um, I did mention I want all the furniture in here to be white, although I loved that little, that little low uh, vintage, whatever that is, vanity. Um, I decided since all the, you know, the shelving already up is white, I'm going to stick with white. And I'm probably going to end up bringing some, uh, one piece at least, probably only one piece from my craft room. And, um... I'm not sure yet if it's going to be the dresser or it's going to be the bins. It's probably going to be the bins because there's a whole bunch of stuff on top of the dresser. So those bins that I have that slide out and um, have all the, the laces and trims in, that would be perfect. So that will come out. That'll give me a lot, a lot of workspace on the top. Um but I did buy this yesterday for $10. It, it'll get repurposed for something else when um, I get things completely organized. But right now, it's just looking too messy for me and I can't stand it. And even though I have a million things to do for next weekend's um, booth setup, I've got to get this done because my brain won't let me do anything else. <laughs> and it's a nice, cool morning. Um Hopefully it'll be a nice cool day. It would be great. Um, we've got some painting and clear coating to get done um, today because there's that um, cedar chest and then that big tall shelving unit and then the top of the hutch and we're done with painting uh, for now. I got some new stencils, not stencils transfers. I'm going to put this on a window. To me, this would be great uh, for a Christmas um, display. I got another one of these country loves with the barn. And then I got this one that has a flag. It has these four things. So, I have a uh, an old trunk in the house I've been using in the guest room, and I want to put one of those on that trunk. And that's all it needs. And then it can go to the antique mall. So, awesome sauce. I'm going to get going, and we'll see if I can, you know, use my skills to rearrange. Monday morning. Uh, yesterday, I really started feeling sick. And, um, 
I had to go, it was like about two o'clock and I had to go shower and lay down and I took a three hour nap, which I never nap, never, ever, ever. So I, but before that I did get this place all reorganized. <laughs> so cleared these out of paint and all the paints in the house. I'm going to show you that too. Move the fireplace. I like it. I really like it here because when it's snowy outside, it's going to look so pretty with the fireplace right there. Um, I do have to figure out a different place for my my laptop. <clears throat> but I moved my TV. Um, I got this little cart on Saturday for $10. And I knew I wanted it because it was white and it would kind of flow. Um, this is one of the pieces from my craft room. I thought I brought enough little drawers out, but I need one more. So I'm going to have some space for storage here, but this is going to be like, I have big drawer pulls, I have handles, and then I have knobs. And then here I have contact paper, nothing. And then I have my, um, uh, like sandwich bags, baby wipes, here I have um, sandpaper. These are all already appliques that I've made. And then this one, I need to get one more drawer from in the house. <clears throat> and then up here, I have my, my stamps. These stamps are way more expensive than crafty stamps. Um, and then like small stencils and then the larger stencils my tea um hot pot is there and then i just have a couple of projects i'm working on um some water bottles and then all my paint brushes right here um i have some more paint brushes these are wax brushes and then i have a thing a chain down there that we use for the windows so I was working on those lamps. I kind of pushed them off to the side. This is kind of my cleaning supplies. I need a shelf here. I'm probably going to take this down and have Honey put up a sh uh, at least one shelf right here. Um, so it doesn't impede down onto my space. But I do need a shelf. Like with window cleaner, disinfectant wipes. I need a paper towel holder. That is for sure. And then over on this side, I still have this table. I told Honey I really want to get rid of it. This is something I picked up back when we had we were going to do the tea room. And I was going to cover it with fabric um, just to use it for a display table. And it wouldn't matter that I had to sand it down. But to actually paint this and sell this to somebody, I wouldn't want, that, want them to have that. Um, you know what I mean? It, it just... No bueno for sale. <laughs> so I'm listening. I don't know. Maybe I could just get him to take the top off and make me a new top. And I could just use that for like what I'm using it for now, which like I have my rolling pins that I have to get painted today. Um, this is just like little projects that I'm working on. I really want to do this, but uh, I still... I'm not sure. I got to find something else to try to get that off with. I've used Goo Gone and some other different products. Um, I have this in here and I bought this to alter it, paint it, distress it, and sell it. It's a magazine rack. And a lot of people these days are using it for their pans for the kitchen. Um, but I was like, well, this will work. This will work really good to hold my transfers. Here's my board of what to do. And I am going to fill that out today because we have a lot to do between now and Sunday. So I'm definitely going to do that. Right now, I'm going to go out to the other building. Oh, I did get this. This doesn't look as nice as it did before. But it's okay. I don't really even look up there. I really don't. So it's totally okay. The dogs are out here. It made a lot more space. Uh, for the dogs to clear this out but I will say that 
I will have probably one piece of furniture in here um, that will be, you know, getting painted. So it will take up some more space, but I'll just move the chair out of the way and it'll, you know, I'll move. Anyway, it'll be fine. But this is my wall of, you know, this is my workspace and this is my storage space. It's actually really perfect. I love it. Do you love it, Shiva? Do you? What about you, Riz? Do you love it? Shay, hi. All right, going out to the other building. I didn't really go out, out to the other building. I came in here to heat up my tea because it was getting cool. So here is the storage now for our paint. It's perfect because I can see in the cabinet without having to open it up what the inventory is. It's protected so that when Shiva is locked in the laundry room, like when we leave for a couple hours or something, um, she can't destroy it or eat it or cause any problems. So I got my DIY. Oh, look, I look terrible. <laughs> I'm in my jammies. Um, I got my smaller DIY, and this is Fairy Chalk Mother, and there's a little bit of Dixie Belle. Um, and then my larger DIY. And down here I have waxes and stains. And then down at the bottom I have my Waverly uh, paints from like Michaels and, and uh, they're more like craft paints. Uh, so down there at the bottom. So anyway, it worked out really well. This storage unit was free. It, it's a really cheesy, it's not a very good quality um, lawyer's I think they call it a lawyer's bookcase um, but it works for this it was free and yay <laughs> well, um, I got to do a little inventory I have about 30 minutes because uh, then I need to get ready and I've got to go to the bank because we did sell the motorcycle on Saturday and so I have a nice tidy cashier's check to take um, and put in the bank this is the cedar chest I was working on last week. And I love how it came out a lot. And so it needs to be clear coated and then um, we'll put back on the handles that are in the cedar chest. Whenever the pond does, does not have water, they explore and climb. Shiva is like a mountain goat. And in the building today, you will see, I can get it open without dropping everything else in my hands. I'm oh, sorry, somebody's walking by. It is a really bad should show in here, but Amanda Wireman, I'm going to embrace this should show. And I'm gonna start doing my inventory of in here. Um, I have no more labels. I'm out of two packs of labels that they gave me. And, um, hey, hey. Um, so I'm gonna to have to probably run over there this morning too. It's about, I don't know. Maybe 10 miles over there. It's kind of a bummer. But anyway, I'm going to get busy on this. this. morning, I carried over a little bit, and there's a reason. So our neighbor gave us this stuff. I got to clean off all the stickers. Just going to put these in the booth. We've got two vintage trunks. That little table back there. <coughs> um, so yesterday, I finished up. This pretty little shelf that I showed on my haul video, I paid $6 for this. Um, and after the transfer, um, I'm going to ask $35. And then I did this. But look what happened. That happened. So I left it outside because I had waxed it. <clears throat> I wanted this to stay outside so it could cure. I don't know. Maybe it doesn't matter whether it's inside or outside. 
but I left it out. A wind gust came, blew it over. Oh, so bummed. But we're gonna take the we're gonna take this out. I might have a piece of glass that could work on that. I actually think I do. But if I don't, we're gonna use this backing and turn it into a chalkboard. So <clears throat> that's what's going on with that. Let's go. Do I have anything else out here I did? Oh, it's cool. It's super running. I carried over a little bit and there's a reason. So our neighbor gave us this stuff. I got to clean off all the stickers. Just going to put these in the booth. We've got two vintage trunks. That little table back there. <coughs> um, so yesterday I finished up this pretty little shelf that I showed on my haul video. I paid $6 for this. Um, and after the transfer, um, I'm going to ask $35. And then I did this. But look what happened. That happened. So I left it outside because I had waxed it. <clears throat> I wanted this to stay outside so it could cure. I don't know. Maybe it doesn't matter whether it's inside or outside. But I left it out. A wind gust came, blew it over. Oh, so bummed. But we're gonna take the we're gonna take this out. I might have a piece of glass that could work on that actually think I do but if I don't we're going to use this backing and turn it into a chalkboard so <clears throat> that's what's going on with that let's go do I have anything else out here I did oh it's cool it's super cool out here Woo. Um, I finished up my rolling pins obviously these will be marked Decor only. That one has a pig. Another pig. This one's got a rooster. A cow, a cow. Um, these are the two pieces, uh, the two stools I picked up yesterday. I'm going to paint them farm fresh, which is a uh, more of a farmhouse green. This is more like a Christmas green. Um, and then I'll do some stenciling on top. And then I did this tray. What do you think of this? <laughs> so this was that tray. If you remember, <clears throat> it had a, the place where I got it. The lady had um, glued recipes all over it. So I pulled off as much as I can. I could. I sanded it and then I stenciled or I painted it white, distressed it, stenciled the honeycomb on it. And then I stenciled the black um wreath stuff and then i used a transfer i had saved this b from another transfer and voila there you go all right guys it is a cold and dreary morning definitely a taste of fall and there is my studio that someday will not be pink anymore it'll be painted like the building all right we're getting close. Honey's got to screw this top on. <coughs> Today is daycare day for Miss Shiva. And I got to go by the bank and I got to go by the DMV again to get trailer tags. We got a few windows that we're going to sell, just plain windows. The Hoosier's going to wait. The Hoosier's going to wait. So. Happy with all the paint in here. I'm so glad I brought it in because it's pretty nippy out there this morning. It's in the high 30s. And I'm getting my breakfast ready. I'm going to have my cup of tea. There's a bowl of dog water. And I'll see you guys next week. Bye.